Hello everyone, I welcome you to my channel. First of all, a very happy new year. Today, I will be showing you how to install Turbo C++ on a Windows operating system. And then, I will also show you how to run a simple Hello World program in Turbo C++. So, let's begin. Now, to install Turbo C++, you need to first simply go to your favorite browser. And in the address bar, you need to just simply type Turbo C++ download then enter and then you'll be seeing this first search result is from developerinsider.co so just you know simply click on this download turbo c++ for windows and it will going to redirect you to this developer insider site and here you can see that we have this download turbo c++ for windows 7 8 and 10 also it is you can install in windows 11 so you can install it basically in any windows version so just you know simply uh, scroll down a bit and you can see that we have this download button for turbo c plus plus so just you know simply click on this download turbo c plus plus and it will going to redirect you to do uh, to the next tab and it will going to start downloading our turbo c plus plus see it has you know rightly started downloading so just you know simply click on the show all and we'll be seeing that our turbo c plus plus has been rightly downloaded over here so let us first minimize it and if I just simply go to my download directory, you'll be seeing that our Turbo C++ has been rightly downloaded over here. And this is a zip file. So first, what you need to do is you need to extract it. So for that, just, you know, simply right click on it. And then just, you know, simply click on extract all. And it will going to open this window. So this is going to be our extracted destination. So keep this default. Then just, you know, simply click on extract. And what it will do is it will going to start extracting. You can see our extract our extraction has rightly began. And it has rightly completed. And it has you know rightly opened this Turbo C uh, Turbo C 3.2. Right. So it has rightly extracted over here. So you know just simply go inside that folder and here we'll be seeing that you have these files. Right. So from here you need to just you know simply click on this setup. And you can see that it is currently preparing to install and our Windows installer for Turbo C++ this installation wizard has been rightly opened over here. So just first minimize it uh, these two folders so that we can have a better visibility and here just you know simply click on next. This is the license agreement uh, do accept this license agreement and then just simply click on next and then it is asking to install so just you know simply click on this install button and it will start installing our turbo c++ 3.2 so this will going to ask you for administrative privileges so for the just simply click on yes and you will be seeing our installation has rightly began and it has rightly installed so just you know this launch the program is already checked so just you know simply click on finish and it will going to launch our turbo c++ and it has rightly launched see our turbo c++ has been rightly launched over here and now it has you know given you two check boxes so this full screen mode if you want to wish to use our turbo c in a full screen mode then you need to check this and also if you want to you know open any live example page on startup then you can also check that but i'll be you know not going to check because it's not necessary i would say but uh, full screen i want and then just you know simply click on start turbo c++ and it will going to launch our turbo c++ in a full screen mode see it has rightly opened in a full screen mode so just you know simply uh, click on the latest project double click and it will going to you know uh, set uh, this hello.c as our latest project so i am going to you know write a simple hello world program so has include stdio.h and then I'm going to create our main method so int main so just you know simply double brace and then you need to clear your screen so clr is cr then uh, I'm going to print hello world so hello world right and then I'm going to you know hold our screen so get ch and then i'm going to finally return zero 
Why return zero? Because I have created a int main method, not void main, right? So I need to return return something. So you know, write uh, this much, and then just you know, simply click on this Control F nine, and you can see our hello world has been rightly shown in our console. So in this way, you can easily install the latest version of Turbo C++ on your Windows operating system. And then I have also shown you how to write a simple Hello World program on Turbo C++ and how to run them. So that's basically all about this video, friends. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, then please give it a like and also please do share it with your friends. Thank you very much for watching this video and God bless you all.